So, this is another day in the life. I think we like doing the unusual ones now. We'll do <laughs> a day in the life with typical dog stuff. But, but now, we've got a pig for the next week. And it's really cool. So I thought I would put together just even a short video to continue to show you that we have no boundaries on the animals we care for. Chickens, pigs, horses, cats, dogs, birds, fish, and soon, likely exotic animals. <laughs> Word spreads. Hi Mowgli. This is Mowgli. And he's super cool. He's going to get his water changed out, fresh water, and some good food. Hi. Yeah. Say I'm sweet. Super sweet. Some extra benefits of professional pet sitting. It just kind of struck me today. We talk about it, we blog about it, and we have it up on our sites, but you don't see it. So I think the cool part about having a YouTube channel is occasionally to see it. Um, I noticed, in this case, an herb garden while we're caring for a pig that had some beautiful peppers and beautiful herbs. And it just wasn't on the list of things to do, but we always are looking at things that need to be done. And that's the difference between asking your neighbor or friend and people paid to, uh, to watch for those details. And not just watch for them, but to actually really care. If we take pride in our work, you know, we're being sloppy if we see herbs dying that we're walking past. <laughs> I mean, it sounds silly, but, uh, you know, it's very, very true. So we've got this beautiful herb garden here, and it's getting really, really dry. And this beautiful pepper, just one example. So, I'm going to do a little bit of watering. So whether it's dogs, cats, chickens, pigs, you know, the things that we do is uh, notice the two newspapers in the driveway and uh, know that it looks like people are traveling. And those are the kind of things we're looking for while on vacation um, and doing pet sitting. We want it to look lived in. We, we can turn and alternate lights and do a variety of things, but we certainly are going to go the extra mile and do things that, uh, that should be done outside of in this case, taking care of this awesome pig. Um, so yeah. I just thought a neat chance to, to give a little video tutorial, if you will, of uh, the benefits. <laughs> There's somebody waiting and hungry for food. You know, another thing with interesting animals like pigs or chickens is if you had somebody watching your dogs before, neighbor, friend, and you're kind of in the habit of that, but suddenly are getting your own eggs uh, because of the trend of layers or having a, a cute pig like this, it makes more sense to then go ahead and get a professional pet sitter to take care of your animals at home where they're used to and kill several birds with one stone if you can. I think we're seeing a trend towards that. I mean, most people used to rely on neighbors. Uh, or brothers or sisters, you know, I did growing up, it's all we knew, especially out in the country, right? Uh, but the growing pet sitting industry is, I think, really proud of the movements and, and they really take themselves seriously. We really love what we do and uh, it's not a joke to us, you know, it really is, <laughs> to sound cliche, it's something we're passionate about or we wouldn't do it. You know, I love the service industry, I love taking things to the next level or trying to. So we're going to feed this little guy, and that's a few of the extras that professional pet sitting, I think, do. The, the eyes um, that are always glancing around. Newspapers, mail, uh, things that need to be watered. Just things that also look out of place. You know, we're there to take care of things while you're gone and to make sure. Chow time. We're going to switch out his water. He's got a cool little pool here. That he can drink from and just <laughs> chillin', change that out daily, and then we're gonna go play up in the yard. He's got a great setup though. Kind of envious. So it's a rock star pig life.
pool going to get refilled? Mowgli is chowing down, and we're going to go out and play. Why would somebody need a, a pet sitter for a pig? Well, in this case, a uh, regular setup for the dogs when they travel, but it's a little more unusual to get a request for a pig. So Sogavi Animal Solutions uh, loves to pick up the kind of diverse animals, and people do need, they do need cared for. Um, or you're kind of trapped and bound and not easily able to travel. That's why I think chicken sitting is going to be a big thing because people that have chickens and dogs suddenly realize that maybe they've used a neighbor, brother, or sister before, but they would use a professional pet sitter that also knows how to handle their, their hens or their chickens as far as gathering eggs, feeding, cleaning out the, uh, the coop, roost, and all that. A lot of urban... Hello! A lot of urban... Uh, Places, especially here in the city of Fayetteville, that we know of are, are, are laying their own eggs. It's kind of all the rage, and uh, that means people need care for the animals. Come on! Let's go play. Excuse my shakiness, but this is our first time to go on out. Come on, Mowgli, come on! Yeah! Good! Wow, he's fast. Good boy. There you go. Come on. Yeah. Freedom. Let's give you some fruit for coming up. I think he loves, uh, Probably anything, but fruit, definitely. Okay. Playtime, buddy boy. Come on. <laughs> oh, yes. little one, aren't you? <laughs> See, you're about as fast as any dog I've ever seen. Oh, yes. So sweet. In Mowgli's case, we've got his food here. We've got morning and night. A little more at night. Uh, he likes his uh, soaked in water. Same consistency as cereal. Fruit and a bonus. And hopefully a ploy to get him to go run in the yard today. Because he actually loves to do that. Are you hungry? <laughs> I think so. Can you say hello world? We're going to go play in the yard today. Get fresh water for the day. And you know, I mean it may sound cliche, but we really love what we do. It is not an obligation. You know, when you're a hired professional pet sitter, you go to love the animals and you really love what you do. And you take extra time and details and continue to find a way to make the experience better and uh, easier on your clients and keeping them up to date daily with pictures, videos, and whatever they feel is appropriate. So that's one of the coolest things I think about getting a pet sitter. Let your animals just chill at home and get loved uh, while you're away. Mowgli, you loving the water, buddy? <laughs> he gets it dirty every day. <laughs> so I know he loves chilling in there. All right, we're out. On to the next one.